Hi. Set up in the kitchen. Uh, the girls are watching Nativity next door. I'm looking at the image of the painting and myself here now because that's how I do the videos. I can see what's what's in the screen. There's Maisie with her cone on. And uh, um, although it looks it looks probably worse than ever, it's actually on its way out that closer. Hey Maisie. Here she is with her collar look. Maisie. Oh. And she's got a fancy, uh, there we are, we're getting a close up of that fancy cast. It's not a cast, it's just a bandage. I'd say you'd be better off. I'd say in some ways she'd be better off just with the greys, you know. But anyway, the vet knows what she's talking about. All right. <coughs> when I say better with the greys, I mean she's, you know, it's fairly traumatic for Mary Maisie not to be able to go out. And she has this little plastic welly we need to put on her, going out for a pee. But she's actually, having said all of that now, she's been two days without a walk and she's been okay. So what I'm doing today here, right? Sorry, no, my goodness. Okay. What I'm doing today is I found a picture that I did for a demonstration ages ago. And um, I wanted to add some more things to it. So I've got my lovely jug here that I got. Thank you from uh, Josephine. Just lift it a little bit higher. So I thought I'd have, have the jug that I could paint the jug in here. And I've got some of my cards that I printed of favorite pictures of mine of um, a fuchsia, which I kept talking about yesterday. So I thought I must be wanting to paint fuchsia and um, daisies. And I thought I might, I might inject a couple of those in here. We'll see. It might be, oh, do you know, I, went, I walked off with my paintbrush that I was gonna use for the blue, like this is, this has been a long time coming as usual. Oh, here it is, it's on the ground. You know, there was all sorts of things happening to me there now. And I feel like I, I have to give myself a pat on the back for actually carrying on with this because there was a plan to do it in the living room and then Lily got up, which is a great thing. <laughs> and uh, she wanted to watch something on the telly. And so I ended up moving into the kitchen and actually it's no harm because, you know, I've got the full worktop here and uh, Anyway, so I moved everything in here and then Gordon, the, the girl's dad, came back with um, Erin having given her her driving test and so we had some food and now, not her driving test, he's helping her with driving lessons because she's 17 now and now I'm ready to rock and roll here. So kick Erin's shoes out of the way. All right, yeah, so it's good. Like I'm looking forward to doing a bit more to this. It feels a bit playful too, the fact that it's not... Um, you know, I think I'll move the tabletop up a little bit. The fact that it's not starting from scratch, they've got something already here um, to work with. So I'll just put something for the jug in. So this is ultramarine blue acrylic with the two inch brush. I just placed something down there to describe that. And I think I could probably put out some red to subdue the color a little bit. Well, that blue is lovely. It's maybe dominating a bit now more than I would want it to. So here's where the handle might be. I put a little bit of, of crimson red into it. That's Lily playing with her, no it's not, it's Maisie, playing with the baubles from the tree. It's one of her favourite play things when she gets away with it. She's kind of getting away with it a bit more now that she looks so pathetic with her collar on. We're all being very kind to Maisie, as opposed to normal, when we're just generally all giving out to her. I'm saying that for your benefit, Claire. Claire is my friend who loves animals. And Claire, she's all right, don't worry. <laughs> I'm painting you out to be some sort of police officer for my animal care. But um, you know as well as I do that Maisie takes a, you know, she occupies a, a very warm place in my heart. Now I've put some water on this kitchen paper here because I want to capture the shape inside. Uh, I want to lift out the shape of the handle there a little bit just to use the damp paper towel to carve in. I'll just fill it up there again a little bit. All right. And maybe to, just to explain a bit more clearly the, the jug spout as well. That's all right. Now I feel like I want to go with the hooker screen. And this is handy actually having everything here right in front of me. What am I gonna do with the hooker screen? Yeah, I'm gonna use, this brush because I want to do something fairly 
not detailed, but just a, I want to find an edge where the dark green of the vegetation enters into the into the pot. Now I don't have vegetation to look at as I'm doing this, so it's a bit of guesswork and a bit of um, hope for the best. Can I carry on? And I'll probably just I'm looking at actually the fuchsia card now because there's there's greenery going in that direction in the fuchsia card that I could use maybe because when I put something dark in one area it feels appropriate then to carry it on elsewhere within reason I mean there's a kind of a certain certain um, amount of consideration regarding the painting looking to that for information and then looking at the other stimulus so what will work for the composition of the painting and then what 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 is it that I want to draw from these these um, references that to add richness and depth and substance to this. One of the things I want to do is to emphasize more clearly that daisy that's already here. It's a gerbera, I reckon. Now I don't have an image of a gerbera, but um, I think just using the dark green to illustrate the brightness of the petals here and there would be a good idea. The girls are there now, so if she wants to go out, the girls will take her out. Mm, just heard that they're going to take her collar off. So they better keep a good eye that she doesn't take her bandage off. But you know, a certain amount of trust is needed, isn't it? Right. Now I think I could also introduce a little bit of orange into that gerbera. I use a clean, clean brush, orange straight from the tube. And uh, will I do this? See, I don't have. What I've got is the daisies here. I suppose I could kind of look to those for inspiration. I don't want to be just painting totally blindly, making new things happen. Okay, I think just a, a bit of brightness there helps. That's okay. I wanted a shout out to Hope who got me this new shirt. Um, those of you who know me will know that I had an old um, clean khaki kind of army style thing that I used to paint in all the time. And my aunt Ellen kindly, um, <coughs> you can let her, my aunt Ellen kindly uh, patched it up for me and everything. Actually she made it so nice that I kind of wanted to just leave it hanging on the wall and looking at it rather than wearing it. And Hope gave me this as a, um, a new one. And you know, I said to Hope, oh, I really like that shirt. And she, she wasn't wanting me to like it so much because she wanted me to be um, up for putting it on when I was painting. So my job is to get this shirt covered in paint. I said, next Christmas day, I'll come with it. Um, evidence of it having been used. Right, what am I doing now? So Erin, you're going to take Maisie out in the garden for a pee? It's kind of tricky with her because it, she sounds like she's desperate for a pee and then you stand outside for like ages and there's nothing happening. She just starts eating the snow and stuff. Will you keep an eye on her though? <clears throat> I mean, she's probably desperate to get out anyway, so. But she's managing all right, so tomorrow I'm taking her back to the vet. Hopefully to get the bandage off be back. What's she doing? She seems to really love, yeah Lily I'm doing a video you can sing if you want it'd be a lovely addition. I'm all right okay just don't sing anymore if you don't want it to be in there. <clears throat> oh look at that now I didn't know there was any red coming in there. Right, I'm going to use that. Actually, the red looked like it would be a nice addition. I'm going to do that for the fuchsia. Oh. Lily's going to go barefoot in the snow to retrieve the lead. Well, she acted as though she did, didn't she? Just want some action in her life, I'd say. 